welcome back to my playthrough of XCOM Enemy Within Long War. Where I left it last time. Oh yes, I remember where I left it last time. I wanted to check, because I just had another satellite shot down. I do actually have satellite uplink facilities a spare. At maximum capacity. Additional uplink required. Right, and scan onwards. Nope, not doing that. Well, I, get to the... oh, I was just wondering if I'm going to get to the council report, but I guess not. Well, at least I have an interceptor again. Because it's such a pain when you go so long without having an interceptor. Engaging bogey. Enhanced targeting system online. Nearing strike range. Oh good, and the damage system is now up so I can actually see how much damage I'm doing. At least for that that one I got a cash bonus rather than another mission. Commander. We're tracking several reported abductions via the Hologlobe. I've got the coordinates locked in. Well, I guess we're off to an abduction mission in Brazil. Okay, first, gather an officer. Okay, all you lot have reached the level I want you to be. So, basically the Master Sergeant level, which is as high as they go. We'll see how many of these we can get to Master Sergeant before we get enough plasma weapons so I can take on Exalt. Have I not got a scout? I don't think I've got a scout amongst this lot. Right. You'll do as the scout. You're outfitted. Oh. Need to make items available so I've actually got enough stuff to give to people. Good. Of course, the downside of using all my experienced people is if I run into major trouble, then and lose one of them, it's someone I've now, now run attached to a name and a character I've got attached to. Which is no fun. You know, when you lose a rookie it's a case of, yeah, okay, they weren't around long enough to worry about, but... When you lose Strike someone one. you've been attached Prepare to... For landing. It hurts a bit more. Brazilian authorities have requested our help, so that's where we're going next. Local government forces have reported a coordinated alien attack in a densely populated neighborhood. They're counting on us to secure the area. Operation Hidden Pyre. Central, this is Big Sky. Strike team is touching down now. Standing by for your orders. Roger, Big Sky. Okay. Meeting you five by five. Strike one has the green light for deployment. I don't mind doing anything immediately. That's always, I guess, a bonus. Solid copy. On my way. Hmm. Moving. Yeah, not the world's fastest moving scout that I've got, obviously. Oh, getting tired of tabbing through multiple people before I get to the ones I actually want. Yeah, we'll just move you You're dashingly ready, over there. Still nothing.
moving out. And my officer. Orders confirmed. Go moving there. out. have managed to somehow, and I don't know exactly how, on my way. Injure my right Contact. side. And well that's you know, not a big deal in and of itself. This is you may already know of this stuff called Icy Hot. Which is you get these pads for things like back pain, etc. But they do a spray. And you can now actually spray muscle areas that are in pain. And it's very good stuff. Unfortunately, when it wears off, because you've forgotten about the pain, because you've had it treated, it feels horrible when the pain comes back. But no longer a threat. I would happily recommend using icy hot on any muscle strains etc you have although the menthol smell it does have is a tad strong 67 oh, I will shoot you but this having a thigh strain is a pain because I'm try, trying to do more exercise because it's good for me and of course you get a thigh strain so if you couldn't do exercise it just hurts more and more so you've then got to rest to avoid doing more pain to yourself Moving. which is annoying when you're just getting the Enemy spotted. I wouldn't say the exercise bug but you're actually starting to enjoy oh. doing more energetic things so, Totally innocuous subject away from the game. But it's been a while since I've had a thigh strain and it's annoying. To put I'm it rolling. politely. Yeah, occasional you know, calf muscle, etc. You know, it's Incoming fire. Sprained ankle, stub toe, whatever else. You, know, you kind of put up with those, but the thigh strain is darned annoying. Especially when you get out of your chair, stand up and it hurts. Then you take a step forward and it hurts some more. It's just... Darn, why did I have to have such an annoying injury? Why couldn't I have had a, a minor, less annoying one? Eliminated. I say, I can highly recommend the Icy Hot Spray. I don't know if you get it in other countries apart from America? I assume you do, because I don't imagine it's that unique. But it's definitely effective. For a, a few hours, anyway. It's not... It's not an all-day going to save you from all, all pain, but it's worth it for a few hours. Mectoid, three sectoids, three drones, a cyber disc, and two remaining those things. Watch the sides. We do a lot of damage. Okay, and that one disappeared half into the building. A repair system of his own. Okay, let me find uh, you. Boy. Forward one space and shoot this guy twice from a flanking position. He did it to you. See how much he likes it when you do it back. Eh. He didn't like it much, did he? There you 
you need auto laser. You or you or well you can auto laser that thing again. And you can do it a second time. Yeah, my drone will do. Hostile pacified. Okay, you good, you do have a shot at that thing. Nice shot as well. Yes, we'll come back to you. See what you can do to him. If anything. Well done. In that case. I'm on it, Commander. Man about that far. Let's see what these lot do. I think I can still hear something moving up to my right. Megtoid's got a lot of hit points. More than one would s expected. Incoming fire! X-ray down. Very good. I'd forgotten there was a squid around, but he's obviously not around anymore. All right. Even though you're hurt, time to move up and see what's over in this general direction. Affirmativo. Objetivo en la mira. A few things. Thought I could hear something off this general direction. Yeah, shoot the squid first. And now kindly shoot the muton. Reactive sensors. Got a lot of heat on me. Yes, that was close. I know it's the graphic doesn't actually signify how close it was, but that actually looked like it was millimeters away from actually hitting me. You. My snipers suddenly can't shoot. Not exactly ideal. Alright, shoot that one. Eliminated. Well done. Yes, please shoot that again. You're doing a jo good job of keeping that thing wounded, Aisling. And you and try and shoot the drone down. Maybe that way it won't get repaired again. I think that's the last drone. I'm about to start keeping score. We're green to go. On my way. And you do have lightning reflexes. Sectoids over here as well, aren't there? Let's shoot that sectoid. Taken care of. You have the in the zone perk, so why not take full advantage of it? Out of rounds. See in hell. We're green to go. Are you killed too. Not nice. Not nice at all. That was decidedly unfriendly, especially as that guy's out of ammunition. You gonna mentally buff up the... Yeah, I thought you might. And you're gonna 
for a grenade. Okay. That could have been worse. Alright, we can only shoot this muton. Now go back to the other sniper. Thank you. Now if you would kindly shoot this muton, it would be appreciated. Get some cover and reload. The only thing you can shoot is that he's got. Okay. Let's go around here and finish him off. Vehicle on fire. Really? One of the tanks is on fire? I should debuff the mechtoid. Got him. Having debuffed him, I'll have a shot at him. is on fire. Now, oh, shoot the cyber disc yet again. Eventually, I will kill that cyber disc. Now he has no drones helping him. Hoorah! Uh, sooner than I expected. And that hurt the Megtoid. Right, you need to move out of there. Yes, come on. Because I don't think I've ever seen one of these tanks explode, but I don't want to be around for the first time it happens and I'm supposed to be standing next to it. Use some ammo. Excellent work. All objectives complete. Oh, good oh. Jolly good show, champ. Spiffing what? Always nice when the chaps go out and have a good game of cricket and, and beat the opposition. In this case, beat on the opposition. at least promoted to Master Sergeant. you got extra conditioning. Yeah, you're good enough. Vital point targeting. We'll take two shots against a single target. And you already get two shots. Vital point targeting is probably better for you. That's ah, bits and pieces. Remember, uh, we will be watching a bit of cash to almost get, get me back into actual having actual money. Saturn. Oh! Yes, we'll do it. That's why I lose a bit of money. What am I going to get? An, an F this time? Well, certain oh, a D. aspects of your performance were deemed acceptable. We expect more from you, Commander. We remain confident in your ability to improve the effectiveness of future XCOM operations. But this sentiment could change if your efforts continue to prove inadequate. Sounds like my last performance review. We will be in touch, Commander. Contact detected. Flying low, so it's not going to shoot down a satellite. But we'll see if we can shoot it down anyway. We're in pursuit. Approaching target now. We'll ignore that for the moment. Let's see what happens to the next. Few hours. Contact detected. Oh, I 
I'll scramble my last interceptor. At least for about three days. And he landed before I could get there. Contact lost. Contact detected. Yes. They're raiding India with UFO 113. Well, we'll ignore that for the moment. And go back. Well, I'm only losing $56 a month. Which is something, I suppose. And I've got a shot down scout and a landed raider. Which is going to take... Require 16 of my people. But I seem to... Yes, I seem to have got enough back to health now. Or non-fatigued. I've only got, what... 7 fatigued. And... 20 wounded. Varying between what looks like about 6 hours. And... 25 days, 31 days. Yes. Somewhere between 6 hours and 31 days. The whole range that covers. Anyway, that's it for this one. As always, because I'm always like to be hopeful, I hope you enjoyed. If you didn't, say la vie. Nothing I'm going to do about that right now. And hopefully I'll see you down the road. Adios, hasta la vista, vias con dias.